So today, James Gunn released the new Flash trailer, um, official trailer. Um, we're going to watch it right now. I am super excited. I am a huge Michael Keaton fan, especially when it came into Batman. Um, probably my favorite Batman of all time. Actually, he is my favorite Batman of all time. We did a tier list about that, um, which you guys can find it in the description below if you guys want to do yours. Um, but it's going to be packed with a bunch of things. James Gunn, if you don't know who he is, was the one who did Suicide Squad, and he as well also did um, all of the Guardians of the Galaxy movies, which are one of my favorite Marvel movies out of the whole entire franchise next to Thor. Um, so I'm excited for this. I can't wait. I know there's issues with Ezra Miller, but Jesus Christ, this could be the start of something for Warner Brothers and DC, which can catapult them ahead of Marvel. We'll see right now. Let's, let's check it out. I lost my parents. That pain made me who I am. I spent a Oof. lifetime trying to right the wrongs of the past. As if fighting crime would bring my parents back. You actually did it. I can't imagine what you've been through. I love you, Mikey. <laughs> you lost both parents in one day. Barry! Call 911 now! I went back in time to save my parents. But instead, I completely broke the universe. If you went back and changed the past, this world must die. You changed the future. Do you know what this symbol stands for? It means hope, right? I will help you fight Zod. Oh. You want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. He said it. <laughs> To undo what I did. These scars we have make us who we are. Okay. And I'm about to go back and fix them. Don't let your tragedy define you. What did you do? No! Nobody dies! You're strapped to your parachutes. And where's yours? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so hold on a second. So, first of all, I gotta go through what is it that happened. He said the part. He said the line. So, if you guys remember this line right here, this is a line from the Batman one where 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 he's with the Joker and he says that line when Jack Nicholson is getting um, he's in the apartment and he says um that line before he gets shot by the Joker by by Jack Nicholson. Let's get nuts. All right, nuts. all right. I heard this. You want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. And then, of course, a scene from the actual original one, so I'll show it to you now. Yeah, this. Now you want to get nuts? Come on. Let's get nuts. And then, what I want to know now is that there's two. Fl Wait, there we go. There's two flashes. This is like, like a Batman type suit flash, and that one's. But they're po both Ezra Miller. So I'm not sure they didn't bring the the one from the other one. Let me see here. That's his mom that we see there. We do see Ben Affleck again uh, in this role. I'm not about to go back and fix them. So that that is his Batman though. 
Yeah, so that, that is his Batman. That's not the Batman from, from how do you say it, from the oh, Michael Keaton's Batman. Now, what, what's cool about this is this part. Where is it? Let me see here. Of the past. As if fighting crime would bring my parents back. So it's all different suits that he has in here. Like this one looks like more of a um like aquatic suit. This is more like the desert one that we've seen before. Um obviously the original Batman suit. Um all with the original 1989 Batman logo. So it doesn't have the new logos or anything like that. Um I'm trying to see what the other ones would be. This one kind of reminds me of a little bit of the um Brave and the Bold style Batman with the blue and the the gray. Man, this is just way too sick, man. What I want to know is, that, so he had what, long hair in here? So Michael Keaton had long hair when this happened? You actually did it. Let me see what else. And then obviously we have Zod from the Superman movie. Obviously Supergirl's going to be the main person in this one. Um, which I think they did a very good casting of her. Um, means hope, right? Oh, there you go. You see both Ezra Miller's right behind. So I think when he went to the timeline, he went into that timeline, which has that person as the Flash on that timeline, um, where he obviously screwed up the whole entire um, Flashpoint. But Jesus Christ, when does this come out? Hope, right? no matter what so this is... No matter what we do, we're not going to be able to fix this. No! So that's Bruce Wayne. I mean, that's... Michael Keaton. Michael Keaton. But you also had... That's Michael Keaton. That's Ben Affleck. Ben Affleck again. So we're going to have both? We may have both... Both superheroes in this one. That part is pretty cool. To your parachutes. It wins yours! I'm sorry, but uh, June 16th, I'm watching this movie, hands down in the movie theaters, James Gunn. Um, this is the movie that's going to set DC apart from everybody else. And I think this is the movie that's going to make DC be where they need to be. Um, I think, honestly, it's, it's right, where it needs to, it right where they need to be at. Um, I'm excited for the movie. I know I'm going to be watching it for sure. Um, let me know in the comments what you guys think, if you guys are excited about it. Um, do you think there's going to be any other more like Easter eggs in the movie? Any other superheroes that might be bringing in? If you guys think they are, you know, write it in there. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe on the YouTube channel. We're going to have a lot more trailer reactions as well. Um, but I'm a huge DC fan, um, a lot more than Marvel. And I'm a huge Batman fan. And Michael Keaton is the best Batman ever. Um, June 16th, make sure to watch it. Um, I'll be watching it and giving my reaction to the movie when it's done. So that's all for me. Have a good one.